Well, the longest month of the year, at least it certainly felt like it, <laughs> is finally over. Storm Team Meteorologist Dave Downey recaps January's wild weather swings and looks forward to February. For the second consecutive January, no snow. It's now the third longest snowless streak in the triangle. Of course, having highs in the 70s certainly doesn't help the prospect of snow. We had four of those 70s in the coldest month of the year. We did get to the teens a couple of times, but the month ran over three degrees above average overall. 45.1 degrees to be exact. Four and a half inches of rain at RDU, above average, but nowhere near records. Look at the triad, though. Almost three more inches fell in Greensboro, making it the fifth wettest January there all time. Now let's look towards February. Most, mo really much of the Midwest and the Plains expected to be above average in the temperature department, but not really that clear here in the Carolinas. The first 10 days of the month are all expected to be relatively close to average. Now look in terms of precipitation, not a whole lot of clarity here either. The rest of the southeast, especially Florida, see that green down there, expected to see more rain this month, but the confidence is not really there for us here in the triangle. Let's not forget about snow, though. There's really not much difference, just two tenths in snow averages between February and January. And while there's no snow on the 10 day yet, the door is still very much open. And of course, it's leap year. We get 29 days for snow this month. Dave Downey. CBS 17 News.